Preset to zoom in, zoom stop, zoom out. How are we doing this? Voice control. Zoom stop, pan left, pan stop, zoom in, zoom stop, pan right. Pan stop, and that is a little demonstration of voice control commands we are using to control a PTZ Optics camera with a great software called vMix. Let's take a look in this video. I just found out that vMix can be used with PTZ Optics cameras to issue voice commands to control a robotic PTZ cameras. It's so cool. vMix has had voice control built in for some time and they also support pan, tilt, zoom camera control over the network for PTZ Optics cameras. So when we combine these two technologies together, we are able to use our voice as a producer or an on-camera talent type of scenario where we can control the camera directly through a microphone. Let's take a look at how it works. vMix is a Windows-based video production software with the ability to control PTZ Optics cameras that are connected on the network. vMix is often used for recording videos and hosting live streams, and in 2019, vMix released a voice control option, which allows you to control vMix with any connected microphone in the system. To get it started, you can go to the Audio tab in Settings in vMix. Under the Audio tab, you can enable voice shortcuts and choose an audio source to use to send voice commands directly to vMix. So this is a great option to get started. If you don't want to use your master audio source or the audio source that's being used by the talent on screen, you can set up a secondary bus set up just for the producer or whoever is going to send the audio command. So I'm going to select bus B, where I have bus B all set up properly here. And then the way that you create a voice command is you go into shortcuts. And let's go ahead and look at creating a voice command for zooming in and zooming out. Just as an example here. What we're going to do is we're going to go down to the key control. Now this is designed to be any key on your keyboard or it could be a stream deck or a function that you would want to use. But what we're going to do is we're going to choose voice. And when we choose voice, we have the ability to enter a phrase. So for example, let's just say it's zoom in. We have the ability to choose from a variety of pan, tilt, zoom functions that can happen when that phrase is spoken. So we have focusing, manually, stopping, calling a preset, and moving up, down, left, right, zooming in, etc. So I would choose zoom in. And then we have the opportunity to select which camera would we like to zoom in. By default, it's set up to be the camera in preview, which is handy because generally, if you're working with a specific camera, it's in preview. And you can choose whichever camera you'd like to control. Now, in the value area, what we've found is that in order to get like a smooth pan or a tilt, you're going to have to do a fraction of a whole number. For example, 0.2 or 0.3 because full speed is 1 and zero speed is zero. So we'll do point two here and we'll click OK. Now I've already added a pan right, pan stop, pan left, pan up, pan down, all of those zoom in, zoom out settings here. You can see how they've been set up. And now I'd like to show you how to do a PTZ preset, meaning the camera moves to a specific location. So what we're going to do is we're going to open one of our cameras here. And let's go ahead and open our 20X camera here. We're going to go to the PTZ camera tab here. And you can see here that I've connected to a PTZ Optics Visca UDP camera. I've typed in the IP address and I've hit connect. Once you've done that, you gain full pan, tilt, zoom camera control. And you can choose the speed, for example, of how it works. Well, let's go ahead and zoom into this geek face here. And I'll hit this create input at this position to create input 84, which is what is going to be recorded. 
So we can see here we've created input 84 here by zooming in and clicking create input at this position and now we have a input in this position. Now in order to create a voice command that will go to that preset we click the add shortcut button we go down to voice and we'll call this preset 3. And what we'll do here is we'll make that function a cut and instead of using a PTZ function we're just simply going to cut to the input 84 which was created for this preset 3 and there it goes it goes right in to where we want preset 2 preset 1 zoom in zoom stop pan up pan stop pan right pan stop If you're using vMix, you can control your PTZ optics cameras with your voice. One practical application would be to set a few specific areas of interest that you want the camera to go back to using a PTZ preset, and then selecting words you don't use all the time to recall those commands. It can really save you a lot of time in a complex video production setup where you want to quickly go to a specific area. Another use case that we're excited to talk about more in an upcoming video is what this means for healthcare and for people who have their hands kind of tied and are doing something and have voice control in a surgical video recording environment or an area anytime when your hands are completely tied. If you have some cool ideas about how to use voice control to control your PTZ optics cameras, let us know in the comments below. We're going to be digging into this more in upcoming videos.